In this lesson, I want to explain how to create a clippable object. What does it mean if you go into the show viewer, you can clip objects with a clipping plane and you can simply move it. Going here, hit H to grab this object and as you can see, you can clip an object here. Okay, this is a uh, clippable object. I don't know, it's, it has a little bug, I think, but you can oops, drag it. Drag this handle here. And if you're going in this direction, as you can see, you can click and drag and make a clip object here and release it. Okay, to <clears throat> make such, a, such a these things, we have an object here. We have an object here and clipping plane that make an animation to that. That we can make it with a grabbable sequence and uh, click it. Okay, here object. Remove the property. Okay, uh, first, uh, as you can see, you have to first select here, make clippable object. As I said before, if you go in here and create a section plane, as you can see, we have a big section plane <coughs> here that you can uh, clip or section all the objects. But if you want to clip a specific object, you have to use um, clickable ob uh, <coughs> uh, clippable object. First, you have to uh, se select, uh, make clippable any object that you want to clip. First, select this oven and go in here and make it clippable. It means hit OK, don't forget it. As you can see, the icon will be changed and here you can remove it if you want. Remove from clippable. And now it means if you insert, if you insert clipping plane that it's here, you can bring it here. And as you can see, we have an arrow here in this direction. You can rotate it 90 degree. It means, it means any object that is clippable uh, is this side of the object, this side of the clipping plane is clipped. So first we bring the object here so that in this direction of the plane, the object is appear, doesn't clip. And if object goes inside of this side of the object, this side of the of this arrow, it means it's clipped. So for the first time, because we want to see the object and after that clip it. For grabbing this object, you cannot make it grabbable object and grab it. You have to uh, make grabbable sequence of that object. It's this way it's work. So uh, we have to make an animation for that object. Go into the animation. <coughs> I delete that sequence. Go to animation and make an animation for that. First, uh, click it here and then go to the this frame the frame rate is does not important bring the up the sequence here and as you can see an animation will be appear here select all the keyframe with this object this icon select all keyframe and store this animation to the sequence you can call it ccc it means <coughs> clipping and you can delete keyframe from timeline and this animation of this clip is uh, stored in a sequence and you can play it as you can see. The speed and the frame rate does not important because we want to grab it. Select it and you can make grabbable sequence. Hit OK. And the software tells you, okay, you select this object to grab its animation. As you can see, you can hit edge and grab it. And please select the sequence that you store for this object. Select that and it's okay. And if you want to, as you can see, a helper will be appear here. The one is okay and everything is done now. We go to the viewer and now with uh, edge, <clears throat> you can click and drag that 
a clipping plane and the clipping plane clipping that object that is clippable uh, going to the one it's a default mode hit edge as you can see a hand will be appear here if you turn red you can click and drag it as you can see it clipped release it it will be okay a little bug i think it has but it's right now for example in this direction everything is correct and now it's correct okay as you can see it's clipping interest interesting and uh, as you can see we can uh, grab uh, the sequence of the object we make an animation from that and you can grab the sequence but this edge and hand is annoying for selecting i hope the simlab soft make it easier and more visible okay you can hit edge again and now you cannot grab it with uh, this circle in the middle because it does not grabable you have to hit edge for grabbing the animation sequence animation of the object okay hit edge again to uh, delete that hand so that's it it's very easy and straightforward you can use it and do a lot of things interesting to do. hello my friends to continue these tutorials on youtube subscribe us like us and hit the bell icon and now you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release